Hey guys, it's uh, me, David. Um, here uh, vlogging, and uh, there's a lot to vlog, so expect a long vlog video. So I'm just gonna get straight into the video. Obviously, I'm not in my garage this time because not too much update on the Battle of Naboo, so I'm gonna stay off that topic this time. But I do want to show you some a lot of new stuff I got. Okay, so the first thing I got in the mail was I got the both Avatar sets. Um, if you guys didn't know, LEGO did make LEGO Avatar uh, back in 2006, and they discontinued it because they thought it, it was actually a competition that people didn't really know about. LEGO was trying to see whether a LEGO Avatar or LEGO SpongeBob would be better for uh, a theme, so what they did is they put out two sets of each theme, and wh whoever had more sales pretty much won. And Spongebob had the better sales, so they just dis discontinued the theme. And it was a pretty... The sets became pretty rare because it was only a month or two after the sets were released that they discontinued it. So it, it, it's hard to get these sets. And uh, basically they're down here in bags and stuff. Bought them off Bricklink for a pretty good price with all the minifigures. Um, I also got... Uh, ATOT with dropship. Um, I also got all uh, the Droid Technic Star Wars sets. They 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 were like uh, 2002 sets. I saw them. I thought it'd be really cool to get the Droid collection. There's like a Darth Vader and like a Jango Fett as well, or something like that. And what I, I've already, I just finished building the Battle Droid, and he is so cool. He has all the features in the movie. Um, you can actually fold his legs up and his arms up into the position. Um, I wish I could show you, but in, I, uh, I'll show you in uh, weekly update number 22 all the features. I can't really do it with one hand uh, why, why I'm holding my iPhone. Um, but that's about it in my room. Uh, let's see. In the Lego room, um, oh yes, I got the new Brickforge Odious, or not ODST, um, Brick for Spartan armor colors. There's the dark red color, the glow in the dark color, and the dark tan color. Got all the colors now. And uh, here's Aang with Momo. So that's just an idea of the Avatar stuff. But uh, I also have some more figures that will be going on my site in September. Um, oh yeah, if you guys see that torso right there, that's a citizenbrick.com torso, and I'm going to start reselling uh, their stuff, including the torso, so that'll be an addition to the LEGO Brick Production site. Um, I think that's about in the room, so let's head on over to the second room. Okay, so, um, in here, I have a lot of cool stuff. Um, turn on some lights. Okay. So, the first thing I want to show you is, why I was at Brick Fair, you get a badge. And this is my giant badge. Brick, brick, brick built badge. And I've, I also went to Brick Magic as well. And every time you go to a convention, you get... Um, one of these uh, bricks that say the convention name on it and you keep on adding it to your badge and it's held on to a, by a magnet you just like put it right here and so you may see that in a couple of my brick fair videos with how I'm wearing that and I got like the op I was part of Operation Siege contributor mock you know I, I got some custom bricks that say legoboyproductions.com YouTube and Flickr my uh, where I live Glen Allen so pretty cool stuff uh, and then I got my Plano V Customs on top. <laughs> um, over here, I've showed this in weekly updates, but uh, this is my Noble team. I don't know if that's dark or something, but uh, you can see that in my uh, in my weekly update. But uh, what I really want to show you is how I got some Minifig Maker stuff, and I, I know I'm more of a CAC, Plano V Custom guy, this guy, Commander Wolf, is just amazing. I'm really shocked about uh, 
about the quality of it. I, I'm sorry, my iPhone can't get too big, too good on the quality, but you can tell that that is awesome. And then my personally favorite is the season four Captain Rex. He did an amazing job on him. And then what I also did is I just took some of my favorite custom clones and put it together. And then also here is my Fire Nation army. As you can see, it's pretty much made out of these guys. These guys right here. And uh, it was expensive, but it was all worth it. I also have Zuko, some Firebenders, and the Fire Nation soldiers. I also have some of these heads. These are Fire Nation soldier, or uh, Fire Nation benders uh, heads, and they look pretty cool. I can also use them for some other use. Um, oh yeah, here's also the other, that's the other, um, this is the super battle droid that I still haven't built. Yeah. Um, and then there's the um, Star Wars Christmas sets, which you can win. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, well, that's about it, guys. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> One more thing. If you ordered a package from me on my site, LeoBoyProductions.com, all that's being shipped out. A lot of packages. I think there's like 58 or something. Pretty insane. But uh, that, that's about it. I know my hair is sticking out. It looks a little weird, but whatever. Um, that, 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 that's about it. So, thanks, guys. See you next vlog.